I'm going to be playing a lot of cool games, including, but not limited to, Roblox, Subnautica, and of course, Minecraft. Swimming away from evil things that want nothing more than to kill us! Keep, stay away! I have a knife, okay? And I will kill you! How's everyone doing? I'm doing great. It's Teddy here from Team DJ, and welcome to Subnautica. Oh yes, it's finally here. I know I said that I would be playing this game a long, long time ago, and I never did. So yeah, H how long ago was that? I I'm sure it was pro. I think it was probably like three months ago I said I would, but now I'm finally here, and we're finally going to be playing Subnautica. So, I've been wanting to play this game for so long. So let's just jump right in, shall we? Start new game. Okay, so, we got Survival, um, Freedom, uh, hardcore and creative. I think we're just gonna go with the traditional survival. All right, so let's go with the. Oh, it looks so cool! It looks so good! Oh, press any button to continue. Uh, okay. Unknown Worlds Entertainment presents. Okay. Oh. Okay, we're jump right in. Or we jump right in. Okay. Okay. Uh, oh. No going back now. Oh, okay, that that uh oh, okay. And uh, uh okay, and uh oh, concussion right away. Yep, okay. Game over. <laughs> All right. No, we're good. Okay, so we need to get up and uh Okay, so we are Okay, use fire extinguisher. Put out this fire. Oh, I'm on fire. Okay. Not good start. Um Okay. Uh Okay, booting in emergency mode. <laughs> okay. You have suffered minor head trauma. Like I said. This is considered an optimal outcome. This PDA has now rebooted in emergency mode with one directive to keep you alive on an alien world. Please okay. refer to the data bank for detailed survival advice. Good luck. Okay, so... Okay, so this is how we select the different things. Okay, this is cool. This is cool. So we have the fabricator. And we can make all these, like, different things, I guess. And... Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Oh, this looks... This looks so cool. How, how do we how do we get out of this how, okay okay so medikit fabricator and uh okay we got medikit so that that's that's cool and it's making another one for us okay i like that power cells they're all at a um, relatively good charge um the damaged radio the chairs that we were in okay so Let's let's do it. Let, let's climb the ladder. Oh. Hello. Hello, Mr. Creature. Oh! And you're gone. Oh my goodness. This Aurora suffered orbital 
Pile failure. Cause unknown. Zero human life signs detected. Oh wow, this is amazing. Oh, this looks so fun. This, this is going to be a, such a fun series, guys. I hope you guys are as, uh, as excited as I am. Because I'm uh, I'm so pumped up. I'm hyped. I, I, I can't even form words. I'm so excited to be playing this game. So, let's jump right in! Oh, we just got an achievement as well. And, oh, okay. So, um, break limestone. Okay, so we got what, what? What was that? It was uh, titanium. Okay, that's that's cool. And uh, we, of course, we got oxygen as well. So we swim up and we replenish our oxygen. That's awesome. That's a great feature. Oh, this looks amazing already. And okay, um, that looks hostile. Is it chasing me? No. Okay, it's not. And it, it went through a rock. Okay, so let's grab this a peeper. The peeper. Oh, it look! I love this. This is like the mascot of the game. Okay, let let's get back to the life pod. We need oxygen. We need oxygen now. Now. Okay. There we go. Awesome. Okay. So we use the fabricator, and we can we can make cooked peeper. Okay. Oh, the poor fish. The fabricator cooks small organisms while disposing of the skeletal structure, bodily fluids, and internal organs, thus rendering them safe for human consumption. Mmm, 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 mmm. That looks. That sounds delicious. Okay, so let's let's consume that. All right. So I'm also let's use our med kit as well. All right, we got health. Alright, cool, and, uh, oh, a storage container. Oh, okay, That we got flares, we got filtered water, and we got nutrient blocks as well. So, I'm gonna take some of the filtered water and a nutrient block, so we are good, and, yeah. Okay. So, let's consume that and drink that. Alright, so, let's exit the pod again. Oh, oh, ho, oh, it just, it, it just seems so cool. Okay, I'm actually gonna look here. Okay, blueprints. Alright, so we got blueprints. That's cool. I, I want to be up here for oxygen while we're doing that. Okay, so blueprints. Okay, yeah, all this cool stuff. And uh, we got data bank blueprints and a survival package uh, apart from that nothing okay so this is like the beacon for the life pod actually let's uh let's turn that into red because why the heck not so let's go down and we got table coral all right that's cool so I guess we'll just make some more what oh uh, uh, okay I have, I had no idea what that was and ooh an egg acid mushrooms oxygen needed <laughs> okay get up to the oxygen oxygen all right so Let's look at what we've got. We got a creature egg and acid mushrooms. So, okay, advanced theories, alien eggs. Okay, so, all right, that that's cool. So we can basically like hatch those and like make and like babies will sprout out and all that. So let's pick up a few more acid mushrooms. I'm not sure how many we're gonna need. The only situation is the items don't stack. That's the only thing I'm not a big fan of about the game, is the fact that the items don't stack. 
but uh, let's put them in our storage locker and also the creature egg as well. So yeah, so let's actually use the fabricator. So I know we're gonna need a couple things. So tools, we're gonna need the scanner, which is a battery and titanium. A repair tool, which is silicone rubber and cave sulfur and titanium. Okay, yeah, we're gonna need pretty much all of these. Yeah, so... I think we'll start with the top three right now. So, we need a battery. Titanium probably won't be that difficult to get. Silicone rubber, cave sulfur, battery, and glass. Okay, so... Okay, silicone rubber is just some creep vine seed clusters. Okay. And glass is just a couple quartz. And a battery is a couple acid mushrooms and copper ore. Alright, that that doesn't seem that difficult actually. So yeah, let let's get that taken care of. Alright. So we already got plenty of acid mushrooms. All we need is a bit more of that limestone croppings, and this game looks absolutely amazing. Give me a second, actually, while I, uh, give me a second while I save the game first off, and, uh, just make sure that it's actually recording. Okay, so, yeah, it's recording. I just wasn't sure, because I'm recording this a little differently than I have all my other videos, because Subnautica, it's a, it works a little differently. Okay, so, okay, so this is one of those croppings is an essential component of all powered equipment. Your probability of survival has just increased to unlikely, but plausible. Um, yeah, I don't think the computer has that much hope for me. Okay, so let's grab some more of this and, uh, oh, quartz? Oh, what, what, oh, ow! What the heck? Detecting sulfur deposits in the local cave systems. Sulfur is an essential component of the repair tool. Okay, we need to get to uh, air now. Now. Okay, okay, good. And there's music. And there's music to this game too, so that's awesome. Okay, so we got some of the materials that we needed before. So. Okay, medkit fabricator is still working, it's doing its thing, so, let's see, so tools. Okay, so we're gonna need, um, we're gonna first need a battery, and the battery is, okay, we can make that. Oh, that's, this is just awesome. Okay, and the scanner. Can be used to synthesize blueprints from salvage technology and to record alien biological data. Okay, so let's assign it to a uh, to slot one. Uh, uh, I keep hitting escape. I'm just so used to Minecraft controls. All right. Okay, yeah. Just look at that thing. Okay, so we can self scan. Self scan complete. Vital signs normal. Continuing to monitor. All right, that that's good. That's good. So, I guess now we hop in. And it's actually nighttime, but it looks so cool at night. Whoa, that's a big creature right there. Oh, I think I know what you are. You're the gasopod. So let's scan you. Let's scan the gasopod. Like I want to get a data bank of all the creatures. All right. I'll leave you to it. Okay. Okay. Um. Peeper. Uh. Okay. No, we need we need to get to the surface. Now, now. Okay, come on, come on. Surface now. Okay, oxygen. We, we just need to get up the near life pod, and we are good. Okay. That's cool. That's cool. All right. Okay, so yeah, I want I want information on all of the things. So yeah, I'm just doing all this. So 
you know, let's get up to the the top and uh, look at everything that I have scanned. So, indigenous life forms. Okay, no, go up. Okay, so now, uh, so we got the coral shell plate. This variant of coral has adapted to survive in close proximity to other corals, filtering nutrients from the water and sharing them via a spore-like substance which grows around the base. Assessment, no practical applications discovered. Okay. So, the gasopod. Alright, so we got a bit more information about this. So... A slow-moving life form and one of the larger herbivores on the planet. Providing a substantial meal to, uh, to would-be predators, the gasopod protects its domain by mm, filling the surrounding water with poisonous and corrosive pods. Increased local radiation levels. Trend is consistent with damage to the Aurora's drive core. Okay, we'll read that later. We'll read that later. So, yeah, climb the ladder. So, yeah. Um, actually, let's go back in here. I just want to get a few more of these fish. I want to scan a peeper. That's all I want. I want to peep scan a peeper. Scan a peeper. Okay, peeper. Now, let me consume you uh, real quick. And, uh, bladderfish. The scan of this other one. May have unexpected applications. Utilizing alien resources is a proven survival strategy. Okay, let's scan that. Nice. Oxygen. Okay, yeah, let's go, let's go. We, we need oxygen. Real quick. Alright, we're back in. Awesome. So... Let's make uh, another. Let's make another cooked peeper. So we'll eat that, and we can actually make filtered water out of a bladder fish. Mmm. Oh yay! That that sounds delicious. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So let's open that and. Uh, Let's take that, and I don't think we need to consume the peeper quite yet, but we will keep it just for when we do need it. Okay, we can actually take another med kit. That's that's cool. So when we need a bit more health. All right, not sure what we'll do with the fire extinguisher. Another creature egg, we'll put that in there. So, yeah. Yeah, this this game's already just it, it's just awesome. I'm so happy I decided to play this. All right, so let's uh, get out of the pot again, and it's already daytime again. All right, that's nice. That's nice. Okay, let's do the boomerang fish. Uh, I I just I just love this whole game so far. I just I've been wanting to play this for so long, and now I'm finally playing it, and it's just so fun! Okay, we, we can actually scan the acid mushrooms as well, and... Oh, this... Ooh, okay, so this is like metal salvage from the ship. Okay, let's get up to the surface. We really need something that will help us with oxygen. Because we really need a bit more. So, let's get back into our ship. Well, our pod, I mean. Base, I guess. It's just, I, I, I don't know, but I am so happy to play this. Okay, so... We can, uh... Resources... Electronics... Okay, we can actually make a power cell. That's a new blueprint. Tools... Um... Oh, we can actually make titanium out of metal salvage. Alright, that's cool. Let's do that. All right, we actually get a lot of titanium from that. That's very helpful. All right, so yeah, that's uh, let's 
quite helpful. And I love how the Fabricator just, like, closes itself away and all that. It's so cool. Alright, so... Yeah, we got plenty of titanium now for the future. Alright, so... Yeah, but let's read up on some of these other databank stuff. So, as we continue with the gasopod, where did we leave off? Um... And poisonous and corrosive pods whose contents dissolve even synthetic fibers. Okay, stay away from that. Filtration system. Thick, non-reactive skin and mm, multiple gill layers render this creature impervious to the nexus acid clouds it produces. Okay, so it won't harm it. Bul the bulbous sac-like appendage on its rear end a luminescent yellow uh, algae grows inside uh, the sac and produces the poisonous compound. Abdominal muscles can contract, causing the algae gland to emit a nexus compound into the surrounding water. Large mm, uh, pelvic fins, capable of powerful movement through the water, when, uh, when moving in small herds. Behavior, gasopod appear to uh, be social in nature and may uh, even use their emissions in their friendship rituals. Their additional calls are likely sniffers of nearby threats or food sources. Assessment, approach with caution. Asic pods may be Retrieved and repurposed. Okay, so we could collect those. Okay, so we got the peeper as well. Okay, cute. I'll read up on that eventually. Like, probably off camera and stuff. I'll read up on a couple of these. Shuttlebug. I scanned this actually as well. Kind of interesting. And of course, we got the flora. We got the acid mushrooms and all this cool stuff as well. I am so... Oh, it's it's so cool. I am so happy to be playing this game. Yeah, it, it's, it's gonna be awesome. So, yeah, and of course we got all these blueprints as well, so... Alright, so we can actually make a standard oxygen tank, which is just three titanium. Alright, we can actually make that. Alright, so that will actually help us a lot out with oxygen a lot, so let's actually make that. Equipment, standard oxygen tank. Let's make that, and does it automatically equip? Oh, it does! Alright, so that is cool. Now we have 75 oxygen, so that is very good. That allows us uh, to be able to breathe longer, so let's actually scan the rabbit ray because I know what this is. I've, I've, I've been keeping an eye on this game for a long time. Let's actually scan this, a table coral. Alright, cool, cool. And, uh, oh yeah, we need some of this stuff that's here. We need these, like, berry seed things that are growing on it. We need this, so... Let's actually scan the creep vine, which is the thing that this is. Scan it. Okay, so let's take a couple of these clusters, and how much of that my inventory? That takes up a little bit, actually. Not too much, but yeah, this this place looks amazing. I cannot wait. Like, I know we can make a base in this game. It's gonna be so awesome. Oh, whole fish. Whole, 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 whole fish. Whole, whole fish. And there you go. Well, I, I got some scan in. I can always... Ooh, giant coral tubes. Let's scan that. Okay, yeah, at least we have, can breathe a little bit longer than we were able to before. The controls of this are a little janky, but that's just simply because I'm not used to them, I think, so, yeah. Let's go into here, and I know that we need... Okay, so we actually can make the high-capacity oxygen tank. So we need two glass, four titanium, and silver ore. Okay, that's not bad either, so... Let's actually see. I know that we need the repair tool. So we need silicone rubber, which you can actually make right now with the creepvine cluster seeds. 
Alright, we can also make lubricant as well. Alright, so we can make the repair tool. Awesome. We need that. Alright, so yeah, now let's use the repair tool. Uh, why would you do that? Okay, so we can repair this whole thing. Fix uh, this whole ship. Awesome. Awesome, okay. So, our pod is once again operational. Okay, play message. This is Aurora. Huh? Distress signal received. Rescue operation will be dispatched to your location in nine. Nine. Oh. Nine. 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 Hours. Continue to monitor for emergency transmissions from other life pods. Okay. Well, um, we'll be here for a long time then. But hey, at least our pod is once again fully operational. That is good. That's good, that's good. So, let's, uh, okay, yeah, and I don't think we really need a fire extinguisher anymore, really, but, uh, yeah, so, we actually got a extra silicone rubber, so let's put some of this stuff away. We got a lot of creep vine clusters, and, uh, yeah, we'll free up on some inventory space, but we're gonna need some kind of storage thing eventually. So, yeah, but this this is awesome. I'm I'm very excited about this. This looks actually like it's gonna be absolutely amazing. So, let's actually look here. We can, uh, okay, we got lubricant added to our blueprints. We got the high capacity oxygen tank and. Yeah, plenty of awesome stuff. Okay, so let's actually... Alright. Okay, okay, so let's see. Okay, so the 4546B environment scan. Okay. Category 3 oxygen planet. Okay. Oxygen slash nitrogen atmosphere. Extensive diversity safety warnings may support Leviathan class predators. Water... Uh, uh, concentrated with high levels of foreign bacteria. Planet is beyond um, Federation space rescue unlikely. It is not recommended to, uh, to explore this environment without hazardous material suits and extensive support. Uh, okay, so basically, basically we're screwed. Okay. And of course we can read up on all that stuff as well. So yeah, that that's cool, uh, and uh, the creep vine as well. So yeah, I I'm really enjoying this game so far. So e ah, I keep hitting that button. I need to get used to hitting tab. All right, so that's the ship. It'll probably do something eventually. So let's continue to explore in the meantime. Clearly a lot of things going on here. I don't think we need to eat another peeper quite yet. Ooh, I oh that that looks cool. Okay. Hoop fish. Let's get that scan. Another creature scan. Okay. Oh oh I see something. Oh, it's a hoverfish. Okay, let's scan that. Let's scan the hoverfish. Awesome. Oh! Hi! Oh crap! Oh crap! Okay, get a scan of it, but try to avoid it. Okay, that's a predator. That's like a shark thing. Okay. Further study recommended. Okay, yeah, stay away from that thing. Gary fish, what the heck? A Gary fish. Okay, Rabbit Ray. I just want a full library of all of the creatures of this planet. Huh? What? 
Did I die? I guess I died. Okay. Well, at least... At least we got some more scans of some of these creatures. So we got the Stalker, we got the Rabbit Ray, and yeah, I did not mean to die there, but I mean, I guess it was unavoidable, I guess. It had to happen eventually. I did not just, I just didn't expect it to happen so soon. Use the Fabricator, I guess, and make some titanium with the metal salvage we grabbed right before we died. That was just weird. So, yeah, big mistake. I did not mean for that to happen at all. Okay, so let's uh, consume the peeper. Let's get the filtered water and consume that as well. No, we, we're good with the med kits. And uh, let's consume the nut. Actually, no, these uh, the nutrient blocks are very good. Let's just go hunt some fish. So, actually, hold on. What can we make here? We can actually make the waterproof locker. Oh, so if we run out of space there, we can actually make that. All right, that's that's good. That's cool. All right, guys, I'm right now trying to find a few more of the. Oh. Oh, we got a life pod message. Okay. Well. Mm, so let's let's listen on to that. Relay message. Receiving pre-recorded distress call laying back. This is life pod three oh. uploading our coordinates. We're plugging some holes in our emergency sea glide. So oh. if we're late for the rendezvous, don't panic. Also, don't go home without us. Seriously. Three out. Okay. Signal location uploaded to PDA. Oh, okay, so let's see here. So Alright, so we got life pod three. Alright. So where is that? Where is life pod three? Oh oh the sunset uh, the sunrise, that looks so cool. Okay, so that's a fair uh, travel away, so let's actually get a few resources if we're actually gonna go over there as well as I need to get like my flashlight and a uh, Yeah, so I'm gonna need some more of those croppings that are around here. I'm actually gonna go into here. Okay, so we need quartz. And holy crap! Ow! Okay, yeah, that's not friendly. Okay, so we got copper. We needed that. We needed copper. And uh, let's get that as well. More copper. Alright, and some more quartz. Materials don't hurt. More titanium. Nice, nice. Definitely looking good. 30 seconds. Okay, so let's get back to the life pod so we can make our flashlight and maybe something else. Like, I want a knife. I, I saw that there's a knife in there. I want that. That definitely. So, let's see. We can make glass. Alright, that's good. And a battery. We need that as well. And now we can make a flashlight. Awesome. Sweet, so let's see, a knife would just be silicone rubber. Oh, okay, so that's not bad. Actually, we got some silicone rubber in here, so... Yeah, let's, uh... Let's make ourselves a knife. A little dagger. For us to... Weapons were removed from standard survival All right. blueprints following the massacre on Abraxas Prime. The knife remains the only exception. Alright. And we got a flashlight as well, so, oh yeah, stick it in your eye, yeah, that's smart. Okay, so we can turn it on and off, oh, that is cool, that is cool, alright, so, let's assign that to one, and this, let's assign the scanner to two, three, and four, alright, I think that's good, that's, that's good, alright, so we got the knife. So let's head to back down, and now I'm guessing I guess that's another creature egg right there. I guess it definitely is. So let's grab that. I want I want to really hatch these eggs. That's one thing I really want to do: hatch the eggs eventually. So one day, one day, guys, it will happen. So for now, let's put this in here. It's the large one, actually. That's, that's a big egg. The other two are tiny.
compared to that. Wow, okay. So let's put all these in there, and I don't think we're going to need anything else, so... Apart from, we're going to need some more food, so let's... Let's catch some fish, and when I need the fish, there's none around. Okay, there's some. Here's some. Alright, um, peepers. I want some peepers. Boomerang as well. That yeah, I scanned a boomerang earlier, though, so not really new. Okay, so let's cook these so we can move our way on so we can maybe get to see what's actually at Life Pod 3. really hope it's something good, so let's make all this food. So let's cook the boomerang. Sorry, fishies, but I, I need I need food, so you're, you're gonna you're gonna be my food. So, yeah, so let's go, and where was it again? Okay, it's in this direction. 700 meters. Okay. Doesn't sound that bad. Actually, let's go through here. Yeah, this looks... Yeah, this is cool. Oh, yes. Oh, I like that. Okay, so let's go through here. Cut creep vine with knife. Ooh. Alright, so we got... A creep vine sample. Okay, so we got some more blueprints, actually, because of that. Wow. Alright, I'm liking how we're collecting all these blueprints. It's so cool. This game is absolutely amazing. It's after me, isn't it? Um, forget about me, please. Please forget about- Oh, jeez! No! No! I have a knife, and I'm not afraid to use it. Please f ignore me. Please, you're going really f out of your way just to hunt me down. Please. Just, d just leave me alone. Leave me alone! No! Okay, let's go into here. It, pro it shouldn't be able to follow me that easily if I go into here, right? Okay, it's just too- it's too big. And- oh no! Okay, we actually got some, uh, stuff from that, actually. Um, yeah, um, coral samples. Okay. Uh, it's still chasing me. Why? Why do you want to do this? I will kill you. I will kill you. I will kill you. I will. I will. I will. Leave me alone. I think I... Oh, no, it's another one. Another one. No, 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 no. Oh, my goodness. What happened to it? Why is it green? Why has it got green on it all of a sudden? Oh, oxygen. Yes, yes, okay. We need to breathe. Okay, and, uh... Oh. I see like bubbles, like oxygen bubbles coming from this thing. A brain coral. So let's scan that actually. Oh, it's giving us like. It's actually giving us like oxygen. That's cool. Oh, okay, so that's like an easy way to get oxygen quickly. So I'll cut back once I'm over there because these stalkers are very annoying. Oh, okay, I found something. Um, beacon fragment. One of two. Interesting, and I see another one. Okay, so let's scan that. And... New blueprint unlocked beacon. Alright, that's that's awesome. Okay, I like, I like that feature. So, let's see if I look in our... Like... If I look in here... We've got... where would it be? I don't see it. Where is it? There it is, the beacon. Alright, so... That would be like a, uh, almost like a waypoint kind of thing. We're actually very close to Life Pod 3. I think... Yeah, we're definitely... I think we'll soon be seeing it. Awesome. 
Oh, and the music kicks in as well. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Yeah, I don't think they made it, guys. Yeah, I don't think they made it. Open data box. Compass. Abandoned PDA. Mm-mm. Integrating new PDA data. Nope. You stay away from me. Okay, you're kind of ignoring me right now. Okay, and sea glide fragment. Oxygen. Okay, yeah, oxygen, of course. And uh, get the oxygen now. Yes. Okay, so yeah, we got one of two. So I'm guessing there would be like another one lying around somewhere. I don't know, but yeah, Life Pod Three didn't make it. They didn't make it through this. Okay, salt deposit. That's cool. All right, so sea glide. I guess we'll eventually find out what that's for. And I see a cropping, a sandstone chunk. Okay, silver. That that's a new material, silver. All right. I I sorry I'm not talking too much, but uh, this game is just it talks for me, I guess. So. Let's head back over to our life pod as fast as possible. And I'll cut back once we get there. Oh! Oh, is it night? No, it's not night. Oh, that's an eclipse. Oh, that's cool. Oh, this game is so cool. Unknown Worlds, you really did the right thing with this game. This game is just genius. Congratulations, Survivor. You have exceeded your weekly exercise quotient by 500%. Your data indicates that swimming was your favorite activity. Be sure to vary your routine for uniform muscle development. Okay. New creature discovered. Alright, so I guess we enjoy doing this. And swimming away from evil things that want nothing more than to kill us! Keep, stay away! I have a knife, okay? And I will kill you. I am so pumped up for this game, so let's, uh... Yeah, alright. Okay. Compass, so we need uh, a couple things. So... We need the advanced... We need the wiring kit, so silver ore, and... Copper wire, which is just a couple copper. Okay, so let's, uh... Let's make all this. So the Gary fish cooked, bladder fish cooked... Okay. And we got the beacon as well as a new blueprint, so let's actually make it to titanium as well. And even more titanium. Awesome. Awesome. And, uh, so yeah, let's uh, deposit some of the stuff we don't need immediately. And, uh, we are basically out of room in here. Okay. Yay. Yeah, we actually have a, uh, we do have the waterproof locker. So I think I will make that. All right. Sweet. So, can we deploy it here? Okay, in we can't drop them inside. Can we drop it out? Oh. Okay, that, that's, uh, no, let's have, I want to pick it up. How do I, how do I pick this thing back up? Okay, pick up, waterproof locker. Okay, let's just put all this stuff in here then. And put that in there, okay. So it'll just sit there. Okay, I just I just found a fragment of the mobile vehicle bay. That I think will probably be very handy, and uh, we got this as well, titanium, and some more metal salvage. Awesome. Okay, so, and that's uh, some more copper as well. So many materials. It's so awesome. And some more salt deposit. We need some more of that. The paper. I want. Oh, okay. Never mind. 
So, uh, okay, we found, uh, there's an, another one of those, like, cargo things. This is where I found that other fragment. Okay, nothing here. Oh, oh, vending machine. That's, um, interesting. Okay. And, uh, sea glide fragment. Oh, and a trash can. Okay, this is pretty cool. The oxygen can actually wait, because this looks like a good cropping. Okay, okay, we, we survived. Okay, good, good. We almost died again. That would have been bad. But thankfully we didn't. So, okay, that's locked. And that's, uh... Okay, I guess we'll take that as well. Another beacon fragment. Why? Why would we? Oh, it gives us titanium. Okay, that's that's handy. Another sea glide fragment. So I guess even more titanium. Nice. Okay, so that's a good. That was a good crop of stuff. So, where's? Okay, we we left. We we went oh, some ways. All right, I'll cut back once we're back. All right, guys. So we can actually make the sea glide, which I know is a very good thing. So. Basically, all we need is copper wire, battery, and lubricant. So, let's see. Okay, so we can get some more titanium from the metal salvage. Handy. So, let's see. So we need lubricant, which is creep vine cluster seeds. Which we have some. Which we have some of. Okay. Simple analyzer. Okay, I guess we'll throw that in there. I guess. So, uh... Let's see. Okay, so let's make some lubricant. Lubricant is essential in construction of vehicles and power plants. All right. All right, good to know. So we needed that. We need copper wire. So we need copper. And uh, do we have any in here? We so and we certainly do. Awesome. So, let's make that, and I think all we need left is a battery, which we've made before, so uh, we need another acid mushroom and another copper ore, so let me quickly, I'll quickly cut back once I have another copper. Okay guys, that can wait, I just got another message. So let's actually see that. This is Avery Quinn of Trading Ship Sunbeam. Oh. Aurora, do you read? Over. Hi. Hello. Nothing but vacuum. These Altera ships. They run low on engine grease, they send an SOS, you offer to help, they don't pick up. Uh, no! No, no, it's Aurora, not like that! I'm out on the far side of the system. It's gonna take more than a week to reach your position. Do you still need our assistance? Over. Y yes! I'll try them again tomorrow. Damn charter's gonna have us blowing our credits running errands for Altera. See what the long range scans pick up in the meantime. Uh, okay, so we do have a rescue ship coming. That's good, so let's let's go try to get some of the deposits so we can actually make this sea glide because I think it's gonna be very handy and uh dude are are you okay? You don't seem to look okay. Oh uh, not another one of you. No, no, uh, oh, that thing hurts. Oh, that thing hurts. Okay, we can actually... We can actually scan that, though. So let's do that. Not another one of you. Okay, these guys are, like, worse than creepers. Okay. They're, like, the creeper of this game. I get that. So, actually, we need to cook our, um, fish. Hold on. Quantum detonation has occurred in oh. the Aurora's drive core. The reactor will reach a supercritical state in T minus ten. Oh. Nine, oh. Eight, it's gonna. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Oh. Three. It's it's gonna go. It's gonna go. What the? Oh my goodness. Oh. Well, if anyone is still on that shit, they're dead now. Ugh. 
What? We have the radiation suit. Let's see that, actually. Hold on. Radiation suit. Fiber mesh and lead. Okay, so we're probably gonna need that. Oh boy. Oh boy. Okay. Yeah, that did not go well. Yeah, alright, that's our... That's our ticket out of here. We're done. We're, we're done. All we need is Sunbeam to show up. That's that's our only hope uh, of getting out of this place alive. Wow. All right. Wow, so many things happened in this episode. I'm just going to quickly get the copper. Please be copper. Please. No, it's titanium. Darn it. Copper? Yes, copper. All right, so let's go and make this sea glide and then I think I'll end the episode there. I'm not sure how long this is gonna be but it's probably going to be quite long. Alright so let's see we need the battery alright and now we can make the sea glide <gasps> oh the sea glide will increase your effective yes. exploration range. For your safety, please pack supplies for long journeys and stay within five kilometers of the nearest life pod or habitat. All right, got you. So I'm gonna pull this thing out. Oh, that looks cool. And Oh, it's making travel so much easier. And it's got a flashlight too. We don't even need the normal flashlight anymore. Oh, this is gonna make traveling around so much easier. Oh, just look at this. Oh, wow, wow. Oh, yes, I am. I like this a lot. Alright, so probably our next. Our next thing will probably be the high capacity oxygen tank. Actually, we could make that now, actually, I think. I think, yeah, we could we could make that now. Hold on. <laughs> Hold on a sweet second. I know we've got silver in this, I think. Uh, yes, we do. All right, yeah, we're making that oxygen tank now. All right, guys. We're not ending the episode yet, but I will end it once I'm done here. Okay, so... Oh, right, we need to make the glass. Okay, so... Glass... There we go, so let's take this off, and now we can... Oof, we need two glass. Okay, we actually got another call. This is Ozzy from the cafeteria. What the hell, guys? Huh? They didn't want us. This might happen. Our pod was almost crushed by the Seamoth Bay on the way down. Oh. Now we're hanging on the edge of a cave system, and this grim-looking snake thing is trying to eat through the hull. Oh. Come get us already. Signal location uploaded to PDA. Okay, so... Yeah, okay. So I'm gonna get rid of Life Pod 3. Okay, so let's actually take a look and see where Life Pod... Okay, Life Hot 17 is over there. We'll get that eventually. So. Yeah, but right now, let's make uh, the glass, and then we will be able to breathe a lot longer. So, let's make this, and there we go! Alright much better. Oh, look at how much oxygen we have now. 135, we're good. We're golden. So guys, I think that's gonna be it for t the first episode of Subnautica on my channel. And yeah, it's kind of crazy how, you know, this is actually gonna- I'm not sure how long this is gonna be. It's probably gonna be very long, but yeah. Hope you guys did enjoy this video. Please do leave a big fat thumbs up. That'd be greatly appreciated. Also, this happens to be the first video that you have seen by me. Please do consider subscribing and join Team TJ today for awesome gameplay videos and other amazing content like this. Let me know if you want to see more Subnautica, and I'll see you all next time. Tiny 6 out. Goodbye, guys! This is the best I can do.